Continental resources on the daily chart. Taking a quick look over here, nice little pull back here. I like to find some patterns on this chart, some symmetry supports that may repeat themselves over and over on a chart. Going to start mapping out my first price relationship. Clicking from that pivot high, pivot low, pivot high. Using my Fibonacci extensions, that's the first price relationship. Next, I'm going to do it over here as well. Pivot high, pivot low, pivot high. Second price relationship. And finally, a third. Pivot high, pivot low, pivot high. I'm going to zoom in a little bit. I'm going to use my Fibonacci retracements. Clicking from that pivot low to pivot high. We do have a 382 retracement that is slightly below that cluster of symmetry support. We do have earnings that's coming up as well. So you want to be patient, wait until after earnings. On the hourly chart, we also have price getting up above that 200 moving average, currently using that 200 moving average as support. So you want to just wait until after earnings and see if you can get a trigger on the 15 minute time frame to go long. Because right now, you don't know what's going to happen because of that earnings announcement. What you like to see is this, you know, a very flat opening. It's not gapping down. It's not gapping up. Kind of just taking it. You know, it's just another earnings announcement. If you'd like to learn how to find high probability setups using Fibonacci analysis, check out my course in the descriptions below. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, subscribe now. Hit that notification button. Our first goal is a thousand subs. We go over cryptocurrencies as well as US equities. Love to hear from you in the comments area and I'll talk to you soon.